Oh, I know this. I know this is official. Oh, I know that's official. The broken glass. Four wings with fries, with a uh, mumbo sauce on there. All of it? Yeah, all of it. How the locals do it. Huh? Get it, I want to get it however the locals get it. Okay. All right. That's it. First meal of the day, we here in DC. Took that two and a half hour trip. Had nothing else to do, it's raining. Um, Howard, China was uh when i posted up a picture on ig everyone was like yo you gotta go try out this chinese spot called howard china they got the best chicken wings and mumble sauce let me see what this mumble sauce is about i got my uh my homemade sweet tea i didn't have to ask and they gave me a straw something about wings and fries from a chinese takeout is undefeated undefeated look at the colors one time Oh my goodness, tell me that don't look good, y'all. Tell me that don't look good. If you're from the area and you moved away, seeing this picture should bring a tear in your eyes if, if, you, if, you, if you know what this tastes like. Go right in. I got my boy Mez, he's uh, ordering uh, some yacht platter. So make sure you follow him, he's gonna do a yacht episode. Uh, I'll link his uh, YouTube channel and everything. Make sure you follow my bro, we took this trip together. Um, he gonna try this too once he gets back in. But for now, we're gonna try these wings. Tell me, this don't look good after you, you know, after you hit that blunt. I'm gonna keep it real. This is probably one of those meals, if you high off the bud, phew. Well, I've been told too, uh, I don't know what part of DC I'm at, but everyone's mumble sauce is a little different. Well, uh, I'm gonna stop talking, let's go. Chicken wings, mumble sauce, and the fries. I'm gonna start a new thing. Yo, y'all know I got the game changer stuff, right? I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call this the O double M. Oh my mama, this thing good as hell. This is smacking. The sauce is saucy. I got my boy Miz. Come on, Miz, bro. You gotta try this sauce. <laughs> Say what? Give me a second, man. Hold on. <laughs> Go ahead, man. Bro, I don't know. I don't know if it's our first because it's our first meal of the day. Let me show my boy man. It's cold. Let me take this off. <laughs> take a wing. Hold on, I need some. You got this handy, man. I do. Thank you, my brother. Mumbo sauce is like on the sweeter side. It's kind of like um, I don't know how it's supposed to taste. I had the Capital City one that they sell at Target. <laughs> the only thing this is missing though, they got to make a spicy mumbo sauce. You know what I mean? Then this would complete my cipher. Grab any one you want. Oh, we eating today. Gosh, Make sure you follow my bro. Did you crack that thing open yet, man? I did. Oh, hey, oh, hey, man. Hey, please, hey, please. Hey, I, I just got this car. I already, I already bit it. I already ate mine. The homie gotta, the homie gotta taste this too. You make me sit up the guy on the couch. <laughs> Right. I need some spice. That's good. Eat it, eat it with a fry. Mm -hmm. All right, my boy. This is that DC comfort food right here. Mm. Oh, let me try that again, man. Oh, the mumble sauce on the fries is like. I thought hot sauce the was the most a, comforting thing ever, yo. I thought hot sauce and chicken was the move. Nah, I need this. Ah, I need to take this home. Mm. But everybody in, inside, they ordering the mumbo sauce 
on the, on side. the side. Yeah, just because you're probably taking it home, they don't want you know they don't want it to be soggy. We eating this right away on this rainy day. Wingtip, shout out to all the folks that eat wingtips mm -hmm. like me. Nice and crispy. Mmm. The chicken good hell. Mm. Mm. Chicken banging. Come here. Mm. So far, the mumbo sauce. It's like a hybrid of like ketchup. Oh, my bad. It's like mm -hmm. a hybrid of um, <laughs> kind of a mixture of ketchup and sweet and sour sauce. Yep. You know what I mean? It's good. It's a really uh, finger licking good. I would go, but I got my mans right here. I like how the chicken is still crispy. You want to go for another one? Man, you don't tell me. Don't, don't threaten me with a good time, Chief. That, yeah, that, that's the one with, oh, that's yeah. a saucy oh, yeah. one, too. Oh, yeah. Look at that thing. That thing's sauce. That thing's... Man, that ain't get you cool. Dang, man. Sucks. Hear that crunch? That crunch is turning me on, Chief. Oh, what? <laughs> Damn, this is love, man. Back home got the wings like this. Um, I mean, how? They probably got sauce like this too, if you ask them to mix it. But I couldn't live here because I be eating this all the time. Let me be a go to meal. Four wings. Fries and the sweet um homemade sweet tea was like eleven fifty. You know wings that went up, man. I know I miss I miss those days where you can get like five wings for like two fifty. With no with some rice or some um fries. Two fifty. It was like four fifty. Oh that shit. It used to be if you're going all the way back, yeah, probably so. Yeah. I'm talking about the more recent memories. More recent, yeah, it was like yeah, about five bucks. Like five bucks, five fifty, mm -hmm. five seventy five. Mm. Wing tips. Sometimes, if it's crispy enough, you can eat the whole wing tip. You got us all quiet in here. Yo, know, I like ketchup on my fries, but honestly, yo, mumbo on fries is a different experience. Man, I actually sauce. prefer the mumbo on fries better than ketchup. Max. The only thing that's missing, though, is some pepper. It's some some hot. You know, I, I kind of like. I needed to be a little bit more. Got some, need some kick to it. But then again, you can always add hot sauce to. You got some, yeah. you got some on your beard, Chief. Oh, thank you, Chief. Thank you. Appreciate it, man. You know, you, you, you know, you, you's a good man, man. God gonna bless you one day, man. You know, listen, man. The Lord gonna bless you. He blessed good us man. already. We got here safe, man. Shit, shit facts. Two and a half hour drive in this rain. Shoot. Just, just telling me I got some of my beard. You know, everybody wouldn't do that, man. Oh, fire. Want some more fries? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm hogging it up. No, well, no, nah, you good, Chief. You good, Chief. My boy about to do his own episode. He's gonna eat the yacht. I'm I, I've never had it before, so I, I'm I'm a dibble and dabble. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try a little bit of it. So thank y'all for joining me on this episode of Mumbo Sauce Chinese Takeout here in DC. Drop a comment on where are the spots. I think I'm just doing one spot here today. Uh, we had some free time. Um, it's raining. I don't have my umbrella, as you as y'all know. <laughs> <laughs> I gave it away for a good cause. I said, hey, man, you, you're a good guy, man. You get that umbrella away, man. You know, it was cold as heck outside. We could have used that umbrella, know, man. You know, you listen. Know, it's cool. We got a car. Good facts. Um, leave our comments or other places to go to in D.C. or in the DMV area. But this joint right here, this is an old double M. On my mama, this is good right here. Oh my mama. That's my new oh, thing. My oh, my mama. mama. The old double M. I didn't, I didn't even uh, taste their sweet tea yet. Let's try this sweet tea with the free straw. Shout out to New York, Brooklyn. Brooklyn in the house. A classic. I've had this before. Y'all know what homemade iced tea tastes like from a Chinese spot. This is what it is. I do like the... Uh, I kind of prefer it in the plastic one, but this is I right too because... That's interesting. This is interesting. This make you feel like I'm, you know, I'm fancy. You know, stepping the game up. I think the other one is um, get more in the container, but I feel like this keeps it cooler. No, I was looking. I was like after further review because I was looking at like damn, damn, nigga, you a cup. But I was like after further review, that's a big ass cup. This is a big ass cup. Tastes good. Tastes like Lipton. 
<laughs> That's all it is, pretty much. I just take one up, throw it in there. Nah, I tell you what, though. Shout out to Brooklyn, Come Cow, and Fort Greene, Clinton Hills, whatever you want to call it. They sweet tea is so different. Good in a different super, way. Super different. Very good. Very good in a different way. Um, definitely not like this is generic, like homemade iced tea. But the one in, in Brooklyn was definitely different. I give them that. Well, you heard it from the man. <laughs> all right, we out of here. See you on the next episode. Leave y'all recommendations. Peace.